And we're back with the Czech interview series with Carrie Booth. She's a project manager at Duke Gal. How are you? How are you keeping sane? How's the greenhouse? The greenhouse has been amazing, um, but it is great to be able to get out, have a purpose to go somewhere every day for a great cause. See a lot of people that I work with, you know, so I get to be around people and we, we laugh all day. We joke all day. We work, but um, because it's no brainer work, we can just kind of hang out and get to know each other and we're keeping the spirits up. The vibe has been great. If I didn't have the greenhouse and I had been home this long, there's only so much spring cleaning one can do. So it would have been, I would have probably been going out of my mind by now. So what are you doing at the greenhouse? Like what is your role? If you could um, so we basically have, um, we have a bunch of groups all doing the same thing, which is obviously making the shields. And there's about a four step process to each shield. So I'm, we were, you know, you have to cut the, slice the shield, then it goes for the label, then it goes for foam. So I have pretty much mastered foam queen. Um, it's literally just taking a piece of foam and placing it on there. It's not, it does not require any sort of skill set, but um, I've done every, actually every task. We move around when we have to, but if you find your niche, they pretty much leave you on that task. And that's, you know, you just go in every morning, you go to your spot and you just start your day. But for the most part, I am foam lady. It's been very exciting. We'll get you a little crown and a sack. Yes, yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> I'll print a t-shirt. <laughs> that actually, I'll get, I'll get, a, I'll get a, a homemade mask that says foam lady. Um, I'm going to miss my phone when I have to go back to work. I do have to say it's kind of a nice change to just do busy work without having to think. So... How are you keeping busy? Like, what are, are you baking? Are you crafting? <laughs> like, <laughs> um, I honestly, I'm not much during the week because when I get back from the greenhouse, I am literally wiped. Um, I've gotten the opportunity to eat dinner earlier every day. So that's actually been amazing. I don't think I've eaten dinner at six o'clock at night in years. So that's been great and healthier. Um, but... Other than that, I, I, have, I have a couple of friends that have outdoor areas. So I have seen them a handful of times during this whole pandemic thing. We sit six feet apart outside. So I've been able to socialize on a very, very, very small scale. Um, obviously been Google chatting with friends, group chats, hangout parties, stuff like that to pass the time. But uh, yeah, no, I honestly have not, other than chatting online and doing stuff that I normally didn't do in the past, my day-to-day -day life has not been altered that much thank god that's like actually kind of surprising to hear because most people tend to have horror stories <laughs> the most sane person we've talked to yet <laughs> and that's like, me that. they're like your attitude is so great i said i'm healthy and i have a job like i that's really all i could ask for right and my friends and family are all healthy best thing you could do is stay positive because things could totally be worse. And it's giving us all an opportunity to have a different outlook on life than I think, I, I mean, even in my age, I've never experienced anything like this. So it definitely makes you appreciate more what you do have. Hashtag blast. Yeah. Thank you so much for being with us, Carrie and Chatting. Well, thank you for having me. This was fun. And it was great to see you both.